Hi everybody. Um, I wanted to share this video with you at uh, my long-standing Thin Within blog because I'm busy doing um, kind of a series at my new blog. Uh, my new website um, is, is basically on the theme of living life on the path of praise. And one aspect of that is moving from fear to faith on the path of praise, or moving from victim to victor on the path of praise. As you can well imagine, the idea of living life on the path of praise definitely impacts my eating and whether or not I will eat to the glory of God, whether I will drink to the glory of God, that whatever I do, I do it to the glory of God. And so I believe with all my heart that you do not want to miss this blog series, even though it's not at my Thin Within blog. Um, in fact, um, much of what I am talking about, I have learned through the years since 2006 of being involved faithfully with Thin Within, and even before that, as most of you know, since 1999, when I first got involved in the Thin Within ministry. Anyway, at my new blog, you will find that I have been doing a series, as I mentioned, and basically my focus is, are you going through a trial or some sort of a challenge? Do you wanna go through this trial differently than you usually go through trials? Do you wanna make it through with an attitude of a victor, with being victorious instead of a victim of your circumstance or of that difficult person to get along with? What would it be like if this time, instead of caving in to our, just the way that we feel, our emotions in this trial, instead we were to allow God to use this to transform us? What if we were to take this trial and instead of letting it have its way with us, we were to let God have his way with us and we were to choose to be victorious in Christ? I have some strategies that I'm sharing at my new blog for how we can do precisely that. Believe it or not, I have been faced with probably the most challenging trial of my entire life just about two and a half weeks ago. And so God is giving me some very up close and personal opportunity to see if the message that I've been sharing for a few years on this subject, living life on the path of praise, really works. And I tell you what, I'm discovering that it does. And I believe with all my heart that this can transform your day, it can transform your trial, and it can transform you. Um, it's not a gimmick, it's free. There's nothing here that I'm selling. Um, but what I wanna do is find out if other people are experiencing the transformative aspect to this stuff that I am, or if it's just me. Um, because I, I do want to put it into a book if it's something that can be helpful to people because it has more of a reach that way than uh, a blog. I would also like to continue to get to speak about it to groups and people tend to want people to come and speak more likely to have them come to speak if they've written a book on the subject and the book has been wildly successful. So sure, that would be what I would love to do if it's helpful. If it's not helpful, I don't wanna waste anybody's time. Not my time, not your time, not my literary agent's time. So what I'm asking of you, those of you especially who've been following my Thin Within blog for any length of time, is could you please come over to the new blog and, and know that what is there for you, I really believe, can help with the stuff that we battle with, with overeating temptation with the things, the emotional eating that we struggle with, with um, just whatever it might be that lures us into overeating. I believe the material that I'm sharing at the new blog can meet you in that place and be very powerful there. And I believe that it will affect not just your eating, but all aspects of life. If you're going through a trial right now, and who of us isn't, um, I really believe that this material can help. And I hope you'll give me a chance to show you I'm right, and if I'm wrong, I wanna know it. Um, so come on over to my blog um, at HeidiBilesma.com slash blog slash. And you will see there all kinds of um, blog entries already. And the ones that I'm talking about uh, start with, I think the title is step one. Um, and so far I'm, I have eight steps, and I think I have at least eight more. 
Um, and, and it's not really steps. It's just ideas for strategies for coping differently with a trial. My dog is a trial to me. <laughs> not the trial I'm talking about, but she's going to be barking any minute. Anyway, I hope that you will give this a try because I'm really excited about it, um, which says a lot because the trial I'm going through is very challenging. And God is working. And I'm really, I am excited about it. Come on over, okay?